One of the interesting effects you would not probably anticipate at all is in the no reflow effect after uh, having a blockage in an artery and having that uh, re re removed with bypass or uh, with a stent particularly, uh, refractory angina, uh, and so on. And so as the motor turned, the pump, that bearing was not functioning smoothly, so the heart had a vibration. And they thought, oh no, this will be a problem. And the only explanation for this was that the defective bearing was producing a vibration in the blood <clears throat> that was stimulating the blood flow because it was stimulating that endothelial lining and creating a, a better flow uh, in, the, in the artery after the surgery. And one of the interesting effects from this, uh, I know this may be a bit confusing, but it's a cytokine array signal and look particularly at IL-6 and IL-10. IL-6 is a cytokine, uh, an inflammatory indicator that is involved in stimulating inflammation. And IL-10 is one that's an anti-inflammation cytokine. It reduces inflammation.